Hello, I'm David Adams, and I teach organ here at the Royal Irish Academy of Music in Dublin. And I want to tell you what's so fantastic about the organ and why I love it so much. It ticks an incredible number of boxes, whether you're interested in history, geography, society, religion, technology, it's all there. History. Um, if you Google the earliest organ, you'll find that it was invented around the 3rd century BC. But recently, in Wicklow, they unearthed a set of beautiful organ pipes that predate that by about 2,000 years, way back to the Bronze Age. So who knows? But we do know that the organ repertoire that's extant dates from around the 14th century. So it spans about eight centuries of organ music. There are hundreds and hundreds of thousands of pieces, um, all the way from medieval, renaissance, baroque, classical, romantic, 20th century, all the way to the present day. Um, and by some of the most famous composers, including Bach, Brahms, Messiaen, etc. Um, not only that, but there's a huge variety of possibilities in the organ, and you can play all sorts of other music on it. And it was often used to play transcriptions of orchestral music. And that's what I'm going to play for you now. This is a transcription by Bach of a famous concerto by Vivaldi for two violins and orchestra. Earlier, I snuck into the organ and I stole two pipes. Don't worry, I'll put them back. You can see they're totally different construction. This is a wooden one, square, and it's a flute stop. You can actually blow it so you can hear the sound. It has a stopper in the top, so that's how you tune it. This one is metal and round, spotted metal, <coughs> and it's a principal stop. And you can see this, there's a slider on the end for tuning it. And this brings me to an important topic of the organ technology. Technology. Before the Industrial Revolution, the organ was the most sophisticated engineering invention in the world. And all the small towns throughout Europe vied with each other to have the biggest and best organ. It's comprises um, three parts, the motor or the ma machine to drive the wind, and then the wind chest with the pipes on it, and then the keyboards and pedals, which hook all this up so that the player can play it. Um, <clears throat> there's a lot of different types of sounds you can get. This is a flute sound. This one is a reed. You can join them all together or you can play them separately. It also uses the overtone series to make a loud sound, so going up through the harmonics. That's an octave higher and a fifth higher again. Another octave and then a collection of higher notes. They all combine to make one note on the organ. That makes this very full sound that will give the power, the strength to fill a cathedral with sound. So you've got a fantastic number of possibilities on the organ, an amazing repertoire that covers many centuries. No other instrument can match it in that way. I'm going to finish by playing you a short extract from a Toccata by Théodore Dubois, a French 19th century composer. I hope you enjoyed listening and watching this video. If you would like to find out any more information, please go to the Royal Irish Academy of Music website and email us if you need to know anything. Thank you very much.